Since the Kingdom of Swaziland is the chair of the SADC region, this year's Health and HIV and AIDS Joint Ministers Summit is hosted by the country. The summit started with the official opening of government officials from member states just before the official opening of the ministers' meeting. The principal secretary in the Ministry of Health, Dr. Simon Zwane, thanked Botswana for working tirelessly during her term. He said the work that Botswana has done would have not been successful if member states did not support. And as Swaziland uh, uh, coming in to steer this ship, would like to assure you of our commitment to working with all of you to dedicate ourselves, to dedicate the resources that we have, and to dedicate our time to the work of the Sadak region. We believe as Swaziland that the Sadak works hard to develop itself. Health takes the center stage. Actually, we believe as Swaziland that it, there could not be any development if health has been left out. We believe that health is a determinant for development. And as such, we, being the leaders in health, have been tasked by the people of this region to ensure that that happens. It is out of this belief, ladies and gentlemen, that would like to implore each one of you as we take stock of what we did in the past and as we look into the future. Speaking on behalf of the SADC Secretariat, Joseph Mteto said, this is the time when they take out their stock of work and see if they have succeeded to do something the previous year. Next two days, your committee chair will be uh, going through or receiving reports from various technical committees, and uh, in particular, your role is to clear these documents, both the background documents and the annotated agenda for ministers to actually deliberate and come up with common positions, which we normally call decisions and issues for noting. On Friday, the member states are expected to commemorate the Sadak Malaria Day at Lomahasha. Polile Mazia Mbongantube reporting for Swazi TV News as Lwini.